If you went to the Clay County Fair this weekend, you likely got caught in it. There were major traffic jams on State Road 16, which is the only road in or out of the fair. More than 20,000 people traveled to the fair on Sunday alone, and that got some wondering. Will the road ever be expanded to more than two lanes? News for Jack's reporter Scott Johnson joining us live from along State Road 16. Scott, you spoke with the Transportation Department about this major project that could help. Joy, let me explain it. Look in the distance right there. So that State Road 16 goes all the way down to the fairgrounds. Now widen back out. This is the First Coast Expressway. It's going to be the major road that will help you get here a lot quicker than maybe going through Middleburg. You can get on it. But the problem is it's still a few years away from completion. Donna Burnett has lived on this dirt road across from Clay High for nearly 50 years. There's just cars lined up one after another going down the road. She's used to the annual traffic nightmare that only some locals really know how to bypass. Well, it's a good distance to the air, you know, the ag center from here. And it will go all the way down over that hill. But thousands of others do not. Look at these comments in the News for Clay County Facebook group. Unbearable. Won't do it again. Never and the worst. So much confusion and no one is patient. But notice what's happening just west of the fairgrounds. That's the First Coast Expressway, working on an interchange over SR-16. Um, it's humming right along. Um, it's actually a little bit ahead of schedule. Sarah Pleasance is with the Department of Transportation. She says help is coming for drivers, but likely not until at least 2025. There has not been discussion of would we open the roadway in segments um, as it's completed. So that means we'll likely have at least two or three more years with fares or lines for the Ferris wheel are dwarfed by lines just to arrive. I want to clarify, this only helps drivers coming in from the west, like the Middleburg side, because they're not expanding 16 overall. It's going to stay two lanes. So if you're coming in from the east, which is Green Cove Springs, it's not changing anytime soon. We are live in Clay County. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, the local station.